Idaho is full of animal lovers, but how much thinking goes into what your pets eat? I'm Tristan Head, your Wood River Valley Neighborhood Reporter, and I learned how the Idahoans behind Idaho are prioritizing your pet's diet with sustainable, locally sourced raw food. Uh, we operate out of Cary, Idaho. All of our employees live here. It's beautiful. We've got mountains to the north and the desert to the south. On my way to Idaho's facility, I watched some distant cousins of our beloved pets filling their stomachs. While they encourage a natural diet, Idahounds is a little more refined. One of our primary criteria is that all of the animals that we source come from Idaho and that they're grass-fed. Co-founder Chris Sai's dog experienced health issues and his vet told him to try different dog foods. This led to Idahounds' development of an ancestral diet. The company has grown to such a degree that they harvest approximately 50 sheep, 5 cows, and dozens of rabbits each month to sustain customers' demands across Idaho and 10 states spread through the U.S. They've recognized their limitations. Integrating is very, very good in some ways. It's efficient. You can save some money uh, and you can like control more of the process, but like overdoing it can be costly. They rely on local business to supplement their skill set by sourcing everything locally in Idaho, with the majority of their animals coming from the Littlewood, Snake River Plain, and Jerome Triangle. But we're so small, you know, like it's, it's, um, it's still like hyper-local, um, hyper-focused on quality. Keeping the business small has allowed Idahounds head butcher Stu, who drives a regimented structure to harvesting, butchering, and processing or drying to our finest practice to ensure nearly every part of an animal is used from tripe to yuchus and bunny tummies to craniums. And get analyses for beef, and analyses for sheep, and analyses for rabbit uh, to meet certain nutrient profiles. Bacteria and stuff that breaks down the alfalfa for the cow goes into the dog's stomach and acts like a probiotic. They're able to produce this range of products while maintaining high standards. And we really treat our food production shop like a food safe kitchen. Everything gets sanitized, cleaned, and, and we would, a lot of the equipment over there, I would feel safe producing my own food off of it. So remember, Every dog loves a bone. <laughs> <laughs>